Hi, if you're like me, you know The Fallen Rise of Reginald Perry in 1976 is one of the best sitcoms of all time. So today, I thought it would be fun to pull up a chair by the campfire and rewatch the sitcom with the entire cast of Then and Now. I will tell you about the original names and ages of the actors and how they have changed in 2023. Okay, let's see. CJ is played by actor John Barron. In 1976, when he was in the sitcom, he was 56 years old. And sadly, on July 3rd, 2004, he passed away at 83 in Watford, Hertfordshire, England. Look at things. Uh, yes, CJ. I wonder, CJ, while I was Would here... Would it surprise you to learn, Reggie, that overall sales in April across the whole spectrum were down... 0.1%? God moves in a mysterious way. Absolutely right. I didn't get where I am today without knowing that God moves in a mysterious way. Jimmy Anderson is played by actor Jeffrey Palmer. In 1976, when he was in the sitcom, he was 49 years old. And sadly, on November 5, 2020, he passed away at 93 in Lee Common, Buckinghamshire, England. Whiskey, please. <laughs> Look, no beating about the bush. Bit of a cock-up on the catering front. Muddle over shopping. Fact is, right out of food. The rape of the beautiful countryside. Carbon emissions on the rise. Unbearable noise for tens of thousands. Mark is played by actor David Warwick. In 1976, when he was in the sitcom, he was 28 years old, and now he's living out the 75. <laughs> More appropriate garbs and jeans and a t-shirt with Wedgwood Ben for Pope. Yeah, yeah, all right, one second. Look, um, I'll pop up the spare room. I've got some old clothes in the wardrobe, all right. No, 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 you can't. Um, anyway, he wrote it. He was an actor who was out of work and decided to write himself a great thumping part. He wrote himself the part of twins. Uh, and so he... Reginald Perry and his play back to Leonard Rossiter. In 1976, when he was in the sitcom, he was 50 years old. And sadly, on October 5th, 1984, he passed away at 57 at the Lyric Theatre, London, England. Saves dormitory town from zip horror. <laughs> <laughs> Milford to see you with your zip hand, Dan? No, no, I suppose not. As they can, and they don't distort the author's ideas. That is the fatal, if, however great the actor, whether it is Sir John or Lord. Doc Morrissey is played by actor John Horsley. In 1976, when he was in the sitcom, he was 56 years old, and sadly, on January 12, 2014, he passed away at 93 in Northwood, London, England. I'm afraid not. I've got a friend who hasn't, as it were, very much if at all for five months. <laughs> Never clue what was wrong. No, but we could have a lot of fun finding out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. No, my, my, my. Mr. Pelham is played back to Glyn Edwards. In 1977, when he was in the sitcom, he was 46 years old. And sadly, on May 23rd, 2018, he passed away at 87 in Edinburgh, Scotland. I'm not banded, Reg. I'm pigs, cows, battery chicken. I'm a success. Oh, good. Yeah, an avatar in Bista gives me group rights. Oh, it is. So what's the problem? Meat. I'm in the days when we were still hanging people. And it was an anti... Uh, really, Pat to punch that play. Um, the next time I went back was another brand new show called The Hospital. John Green Grove's display of actress Sue Nicole's. In 1976, when she was in the sitcom, she was 33 years old, and now she's living out there at 80. Quick, quick, uh, John, maps, maps. Lancashire? Forgive me, you know, sure. I've just kind of got to go back to it, and people understand. Yeah, you always, if you're But they're lovely, and I don't mind broken more cameras having pictures. <laughs> you. Elizabeth Perrin is played by actress Pauline Yates. In 1976, when she was in the sitcom, she was 47 years old. And sadly, on January 21st, 2015, she passed away at 85 in Northwood, London, England. Go over and see the, uh, the hippopotamus, huh? I thought, your mother. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? I thought I... Rosemary, darling. You're late, of course. <laughs> Goodness, you're here. Hello, Mum. Hello. Dad? McBlain is played by actor Joseph Brady. In 1978, when he was in the sitcom, he was 50 years old. And sadly, on June 12, 2001, he passed away 72 in London, England. 
Ja, du vet se. Ja, per är brunet här slogs. Nej, kragel och jag gick inte. Good, good, good. I must say I like your attitude, McLean. Mrs. Deacon is played by actress Hilary Mason. In 1976, when she was in the sitcom, she was 59 years old, and sadly on September 5, 2006, she passed away at 89 in Milton Keynes, Buckinghamshire, England. You're about your colour, aren't you? No, no, I'm just a bit sunburned from the open-air life, that's all, Mrs. Not Deacon. that I'm prejudiced, but it's the religious side, isn't it? I mean, you got your customs, we got ours. No, I'm not, please. Linda Patterson is played by actress Sally Jane Spencer. In 1976, when she was in the sitcom, she was 28 years old, and now she's living happily at 75. You can't hide that sort of thing from your own wife. I must say, I think you're behaving very irresponsibly. So what about your mother? She shouldn't be falling in love with me so soon after my death. <laughs> Tom is played actor Leslie Schofield. In 1978, when he was in the sitcom, he was 40 years old, and now he's living healthy at 85. Even Harrison, of Harrison, Harrison and Harrison cold shouldered me. I wouldn't have been surprised if it had been Harrison or Harrison, they're swine, but Harrison, he was my friend. <laughs> Colin Pillock is played by actor Timothy Carton. In 1977, when he was in the sitcom, he was 38 years old, and now he's living healthy at 84. The right to ask all the questions? Well, of course I do, I'm the interviewer. Tell me, Pillock, when can't get over the <laughs> Why did you take up interviewing? Well, you see, as a child, I was rather sickly. I had... Who is your favorite character in the sitcom The Fallen Rise of Reginald Perrin? And what do you think when some actors have passed away? Leave your comments below this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe to the channel, and ring the bell to wait for my next videos. Thank you and see you again.